What's up vaping family and welcome to another one of my reviews. In this week's review, we are tackling the next step in the hardware. As in the last one, we tackled a pod kit. Now we are tackling a pod mod, which is pretty much your next step up from coming from next salts and gradually working your way into the love of this awesome, awesome lifestyle. So please sit right back and check what we will be unboxing. Okay, let's see what we have right here. And basically, as you can see, cover right here comes with your warning. And yeah, we are tackling the Unico Mod Pod. Or Pod Mod, <laughs> whatever way we want to say. But you can check the box here once again. You can check the authenticity. Yeah, just scratch it. Check on the side, which is nice. Just to see if it's not blown. And we hope that that does not happen in this country. And yes, we are looking at our contents. And our contents here will be what's inside the box. It's two coil cylinder, one battery, which is the mod itself, one pod, which you will be putting the coils in, USB cable, US, the user manual, and then, yes, a lanyard, just for something to be convenient to carry around. And the specification on this is the pod capacity is 3.7 mils or 2 mils. Then we have the resistance, which is you can go from your, this is your variety of, of uh, coils that you can get for this device, which is a 0 0.3 to 0 0.6. Those would probably be your direct lung function and then you've got your 0 0.8 and your 1.2 which is your MTL or your mix salt users out there or using your MTL juices. The battery capacity capa capacity is 1500 milliamps. The charging is from 1.5 to 2 hours. The dimensions is 106 by 27.6 by 27.3 millimeters and yes as the back is just giving you your warnings as you can see right here and yeah may i also just add as you can see this device i've got here is the ink but may i mention that you got a beautiful variety of different um looks for this device you got the plain red well the red doesn't look too plain the gold the dark red the camouflage the line the ink which is this one and then carbon fiber but let's get to it shall we and as you see very nice device and as you can even look in the sides We've got these nice little looks. I decided to go with the ink, something different, and just look at that. Such a beautiful, I don't know, I just get such a nice marble feel out of just looking at it. And as you can see, this is your device over here. Then you've got your little pod. And if you look at the rest of the contents, you left this. Here's your user manual, which also very much spread out, just giving you a good idea of what you're going to be doing. Quite a big manual, in fact. <laughs> and yes, as you can see, we have certain things that are just telling you the power on off, that five seconds or the five times that you'll be pressing, which is very much basic, which we all do. Then you've got your lock and unlock, which is your power button and your plus that you push together and then it locks the device that it doesn't fire in your pocket. Then your wattage lock, you can do that with your plus and minus that you don't have to switch through those wattages or your pocket doing it for you. Then you're doing your power saving mode. Power saving mode, basically the screen will go off after 30 seconds or it will dim after 10 seconds which is nice to just save that little bit of power. Then it's got it's your nice little safety functions like your charging, you've got your check your battery. If it's too low, then your temp is too high. If the device warms up too much, which doesn't really happen. Um, then the timeout, um, and then you've got 
the atomizer short if it's not seated in properly and then yes check your atomizer if there's no foil or anything available then it just gives you your attentions and there you go and this thing is no wonder it's such a big thing because it is available in so many different languages and with the specs already there which we've already read out not too bad and very user-friendly I might add then inside here you'll be getting your little charging cable quite short but for a small device like this this thing can pretty much hang and charge which is quite nice then you get your spare little coil which I have already taken out because I wanted to test the, the, the the salts on this as previously I've done the the, the miso pod kit and with this yes you're getting yourself a 0 0.8 which is already a bit of a border already on the borderline of your next salts any lower than this and that is a bit scary but obviously you'll get your next one which is the 1.2 which is also called your next salts then you're getting yourself nice little lanyard which is pretty decent which i will definitely do in the review um just to show you guys the function or what is basic what it does but also when you do go into these events and things like that it's nice to have this little guy hanging around your neck which is pretty much convenient for your use and just going on and just your little card over here just showing you just another little guidance that basically with your direct lung you'll be using your lower homage and your higher homage would be for your neck salts and when you're looking at this device let me show you this because i probably will not be able to show you very easily on the review itself but as you see this screws out over here and you've got your little coil which is already pre-installed and sorry that it does look a little bit saturated because I have already started putting uh, juice inside here yeah, getting ready for it and all you do is with this it screws in pretty much an easy function and there you go pops in there and you just screw in there you don't have to over tighten too much it does have a bit of a lock in it so you don't have to go and grab a wrench or a vice <laughs> You don't exactly want to strip these threads and as you see here is actually which is a different thing for a change so what we have noticed now is that this thing's airflow is controlled by the same thing that actually locks in it locks in there so obviously with with um next salts i was finding myself restricting it but for those of you that want the bigger airflows that is an option and obviously when it comes to direct lung you're going to want to go all out or with me i find myself with my bigger tanks going on to halfway or three quarters but we'll go for standard by that and a nice thing about a lot of people are looking into this is it's magnetic yay magnetic people so that also will just ensure that this little guy doesn't go pop and you've just lost that part <laughs> but there you guys have it very much pretty simple and the nice thing i've also picked up with this device is it comes in different colors which is pretty awesome and you won't be able to see this pretty much because it's no it's no surprise that i am actually using a green screen so that will not allow me and i like my green you pop it three times and you can see there you've got you've got your different colors here's your white you saw the red there's your blue you've got your like a cyan nice blue and there we're back at green which is pretty awesome and then yes you've got your plus your minus and you've got your fire button which is pretty user friendly which is so nice and there you have it thank you for looking at the boxing and let's head over to the next scene shall we what an awesome looking device yet looks so user friendly and so damn good looking and yes you guys could see that you've had a quite a variety of good looking choices to pick from and you do have the variable selection of coils that you like. 
and I just forgot to mention that yes, you get the 0.3 ohm with this for that direct lung usage. And as promised, I've got it here on the lanyard. <laughs> and it's quite cool. I could picture myself going to an event and just missioning around with this, just hanging out and just picking up, take my hit and go on. And yes, okay, I'm also pretty new with hanging devices around my neck, but I'm pretty sure I've got it right over here. Some would probably put mid screen, maybe at the bottom, but obviously in a place that it can't fling and become somebody else's property. And as you can see, once again, so damn good looking right there. And I just want to say once again, thanks to Mithy for giving me this awesome, awesome opportunity. And yes, I've provided links below. Well, as you can see, I've got this nice little shirt once again on. These guys are awesome. They are hosting these great events, just bringing the community back together with their charity. They're also running the Pay It Forward box that just helps everybody out. Put in and if you see something you like, grab out. But yes, everything is nice and mutual, running nicely and such an awesome crowd. And the juice of the day that I'm going to be running in this and yes, I have been testing the direct, uh, well, been running on the, the NTL, just testing, comparing it to the previous device, and I'm just getting that flavor. So this thing is spot on for you salt neck users as well, or neck salt. And we are going to go ahead with the direct lung approach now, just coming from that, you're loving the flavors, you're loving the hits you're getting from it, and you want to gradually work your way into less strength of salt or any of nicotine that you've been using and this is where this little device can give you the start to the finish just growing in the process of being a vapor and the juice of the day i am going to be using omega from emissary elixirs and yeah they say well the flavor profile of this year is a buttery finger of biscuits soaked in dark roasted espresso syrup laid with full body cream and finished with a light dusting of coca a traditional tiramisu dessert vape that is simply delicious and made the emissary way huh, this is pretty cool and i have also for safety i have already primed this um coil that's inside here but as you can see pretty neato way of just filling these guys up and you've got this nice view this side and this side just to see how much juice you've got left which is very very visible from when it is on the device and you can easily fill this up with it being on the device too so you have options so let's pop this guy let's fill this up Easy as that. Pop it in. And I am utilizing this right now so we can just unclip this and use this for our convenience. Let's fire this bad boy up. And immediately the smart mode on this device is going to pick up that I put this coil in, which is a 0.3. And it's already going to safety of 35 watts. And if I go to max, it's probably going to tell me what the max is, which is 45, 49 watts. And it will actually give you that little warning there, which is quite cool. So we can try and start this with what the smart mode has recommended. And let's see this flavor. Woo! Wow, the flavor kicks on this thing. Damn! Okay, I'm just gonna pop this up a bit more. A bit better. And I love my desserts. So I'm thinking we're gonna be going safe yarn to 45 watts now. Oh, that's so good. Pretty decent flavor right there. And yes, I am getting that nice little 
that Butterfinger tea, the biscuits, you know, those ones that we all pretty much grew up with. And then, then that nice espresso syrup that has just got that nice sweet, but yet that nice little coffee bit taste at the back around. And then with a nice cream, a nice sweet cream to finish it. And then just popping it right at the end, that little hint of cocoa, giving you that perfect tiramisu filler like flavor. This is really good. And that's why this has been on the market for so damn long. People are constantly debating between Omega and Alpha. I know a lot of guys are fighting this fight to see which is the better. But yes, the topic is on Omega right here. Once again, on point flavor. And just, I need to add that this device is just bringing out such a good flavor. This flavor I have tried on drippers. I've tried it in tanks. I myself, no secret there that I am using the not dab. I'm using the dead drop for the dead rabbit b2 rta and i've been trying this in the drop dead rabbit b2 as well in fact i would love to get my hands on the v3 real soon the flavor is just so damn on point just coming from this little coil that you were putting there and yes these are available so check out where you can find these devices and you will get these coils and it's also just my own choice but from the one that just comes with the box pre-installed this is pretty damn good really good yo and also when you do get this thing out this is what i have found that it was already halfway charged so from there i was already popping the nick salt in there and I think I charged this thing for the first time yesterday, which is about a good two days after receiving it, just on the half battery. I think with direct lung, you would easily be on a full day, possibly even more, running this device without hitting a charge. And just taking an hour and a half to two hours to charge, really. You can put this thing on charge overnight, fully charged, and then this little screen will just go off after the charging. A nice little device, well, a nice little thing that also shows you is you've got a puff meter which will tell you how much, if you want to work out how much you're getting out of that coil, how much you're getting out of just filling a tank. So that's also pretty nice just to keep track of all these little things. And the bit I'm just getting. That is a 2.4 second hit thing which is more than enough where I would be pushing a good five second hit for a cloud. But this thing, that is pretty fat right there. A decent cloud right there. That's just coming from this little dynamite right here. And like I said, I'm loving the colors because obviously I've also just had pretty plain mono screen devices and yeah, you get this little variable color change that you can change it, which I've showed you in the unboxing as well. Pretty nice device, guys. Really nice. And if you do want to erase that little puff counter, all you need to do is fire and minus. Hold it in for a few seconds and boom, it's back to zero. Really to count on that next amount of juice, whatever you've thrown in there. Also quite easy to clean out the tank. Obviously switching from salt over into a normal free base, it was quite easy just to take out, just rinse it out, fling it. There was very much nothing left in the tank and we were good to go. And the priming was pretty easy. I just had to take a drop on the cotton ends, just pop it once around, let that soak in, and then I had to go twice, let that soak in, and on the third time, you see it's still leaving that nice little wet patch. Give it a few seconds and you'll start seeing from the above of the coil, you are going to see the whiteness starting to get a bit soaked. Soaked would be the right word. Or primed. Whatever you choose. But same meaning. <laughs> but this is really a good device. And in fact, yes, I will say again, that those of you that have been on the pod devices do get over the stinkies, but you're loving the flavor so much, but you're also loving the hit from this, and you want to start dropping on that next strength that you are getting, that you, you really want to quit and start going down on the milligrams. 
then this is indeed a great device to go for because you can start from that nice NTL mode, still hitting what you were hitting on that card device and just going over to switching over to free base and then you can start working your way down. And then you've got yourself a decent device. You don't, you know you're not missing out. You are getting something decent compared to all the box mods and tanks out there. This is pretty much an awesome thing to go with. And once again, just showing that these things are a great investment of that quitting, things that you don't have to dispose of, things that are worth putting your money down and you will be saving in the process and also very shortly. So just think once again, guys, for the environment and for what these things are doing. These juices are providing so many profiles, so much what you guys are looking for. There's such a good variety. And for you local budge, you are blessed. You've got basically the best flavors in the world, right? Yeah. And the rest of the world needs to get our juices over there because it's just so much on a higher level. And yes, we do belong to the biggest foodie nation in the world. We know what we want. And we are very critical when it does come to different flavor profiles. But once again, this device would definitely be something suited to your needs for that transition. And in fact, wow, I'm loving this device. Even though all these other devices I've got hands-on carrying around with me all day. This is definitely something I would love to have close. And just enjoying Possibly a third flavor because I do have two different devices for two different profiles. So yes, I've got a very picky palette. But this is indeed something nice to just pop in and just break away from those other profiles and enjoy. So well done. And I must just say from this device to the pick of the day, Vishy approves. This was such an awesome experience and i thank you guys once again for making this possible and for those of you that are taking the time to view this footage thank you guys i really appreciate the support and yes don't be shy share it share it with everybody that is possibly looking in the market right now and just looking for something to get into and show these guys some love get them known for you shop owners guys you will not be disappointed these things are so reliable and that's definitely something you want to have stocked it's such a damn good looking device and yet so easy to use and like i said this whole thing with the it's basically saving all those extras of putting things on the top less rotation rotating things and in fact something you don't have to play with or possibly getting shifted in your pocket you've got this nice little air vent right here which is going to be stationed inside here and you don't have to worry about it setting itself the whole time so once again you've got all those things to your convenience setting making it permanent and it will not have that uh, that occasional disappointment to you avoiding all of this all at once so think again guys, this is definitely something you'd really love to get. And once again, I just want to give Univapor a huge shout out. These guys are giving me such an awesome opportunity, finally going into the whole hardware line, which I'm loving and just getting to know these devices and just showing it to you guys. And yes, these are not overly priced too. These things are really well, well priced, economic range. And they are doing so much for you and the flavor is so on point you can definitely enjoy this and just make those around you jealous and get them to want some more <laughs> and yes just check down it below in the description i've provided links i've provided the descriptions of what i've done here today and yes also just give emissary emissary elixirs a shout out for the amazing products that they are bringing out check out where they're involved and just get them known please share as much because that's how we grow and yes as the shirt you've seen right here these guys are doing a lot for the community i would love to get them bigger bigger let them grow and they're nice and local here by us in johannesburg they are but they are doing so much for the community and also helping those others just getting their name known out there and they're growing We've got an amazing, amazing expo that's also up and coming. So you don't want to miss out. Check the links provided below and get hooked up. 
and check out. You don't want to miss out. And it will be such an honor to actually meet you guys out there. It would really. I love meeting new people. And also, just want to stay in touch. Just check. I've provided additional uh, links just to be in touch with what I'm posting. And also, if you guys want to know all about this, vaping saved my life. Get educated and check all the links I've provided. And yes, if you're finding out that the media is talking bullshit to you, off on. These guys know the facts. They're going all out there. It's all voluntary. And these guys are dedicating themselves to making this and keeping this authentic and a greater solution for those that want to quit their smoking, as well as those that really want to start experiencing the new flavors out there and yes this thing could aid you in so many ways also so healthy those of us that have been vaping for over five years don't have any issues so yeah guys i just once again to say thank you and this is me will fishy signing out and remember keep banging those clouds and keep swimming cheers